Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we, Riddler? Riddler says I want out. Actually, I will unlock the door. Can't come out yet. How are we doing, Emeril? Say I want out too. How are we doing, Sassy? Say it's hot and Emeril won't leave me alone. Emeril. Emeril, leave her alone. So, today my brother and I are going to Calhoun to visit my grandparents. Yay! That should be fun. So we're getting dressed right now. I was up pretty early because of the dogs. Then slept in for another little bit once they were done using the bathroom. And yeah, got a shower, got dressed. Ow! Riddler, chill! Please, chill. The dogs don't know what chill mean. You don't know what chill is. Neither do you. So, yeah, Tyler and I are getting ready, and then we'll be heading off to Calhoun. So, just wanted to tell you guys good morning, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey, guys! There be my boys. And there be my big girl over there. So, how the day has been, because it's like 8.30 now. It's been a good day. My brother and I went to see my grandparents in Calhoun. That was a lot of fun. Um, I got to my... Aunt and uncle are moving in with them because they were renting a house that suddenly the owner's just like, hey, I sold your house. You gotta go. So, goody. So, their dog is moved in with my grandparents' dog. I don't know if I ever told you about my grandparents' dog. His name is Barney. He is a long-haired chihuahua and he is Satan as a dog. Like, this dog will pretend, he'll come up to you being like, oh, pet me, pet me. And then he will bite you. If you are not my grandmother. He will try to bite you. He is the epitome of Satan as a freaking dog. Ugh. And so my aunt and uncle have a normal chihuahua named Miklo. And Miklo is a much nicer dog. So I played with Miklo. I did a little bit of training on him. And on Barney. Barney tried to kill me, but Miklo was like, yes, treats. And then I got to tell my grandparents today about what MRL is for. And they were all 100% supportive. They're like, oh, that's great. And my first thought, though, was like, why can't my own mother be as supportive as my grandparents are? I didn't think my grandparents would understand as much. But... They are cool with it. They're like, okay, yeah, that's awesome. So, you've gotten approval, Popper. What do you think? Do you even care? No. Yeah, I want to play with my Kong. My knockoff Kong, but I love it. It's my favorite toy. Especially the rope. The rope is my favorite. Um, and then... We left around four, close to five. So we stayed there for about three hours. And then stopped at Panda Express for dinner. And um, I happened to see on Instagram where Kaylee from Days at a Time, her dog Bentley, though now he's doing better, at that time he was really sick. And she has been asking for prayers for him, so... If you believe in like in prayer or lighting a candle or whatever you do, and keep Kaylee and Bentley in your thoughts. Bentley is doing a lot better. He's awake. He's drinking water. He's acting more like himself. And of course, pray for Kaylee because she's probably had a very emotionally distraught day after what has happened. So. And immediately I asked her, I'm like, okay, what's going on? Is he okay? And because I worked as a vet, a vet assistant, not a vet, what? My first thoughts were, did he have a seizure? Did he hurt his head? Did he eat something? What happened? Blah, 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 blah. And luckily by the time I got home, I heard good things. So I was just like, yes. Um, got home and my package from Japan arrived. Yay. It has three pop and cooking sets which are basically powdered candy um my brother and i already made two of them but i'll show you the third one 
And it is takoyaki, which is basically octopus balls. So, yum. I'm going to make a video on Close Enough Cosplay for that one. What do you think, Riddler? Do you want the takoyaki? Do you want the takoyaki? What you boys think? You want the takoyaki? The other... Oh, my goodness, you nearly fell. Honey. The other ones were the Okasama lunch and the ramen. So, we made those. That was great. And now I'm working on the day before yesterday's vlog. And then... Technically yesterday's vlog, but I shot it this morning because I was so busy yesterday. I didn't have time to record So yay And otherwise it's a pretty pretty good night So just wanted to catch you guys up on what's been going on today, and I'll check back in with you later Well, you're kind of awake kind of not She is definitely asleep he is. That's your answer. Just so you know, Emeril, you have the best mommy in the entire world, if I do say so myself. And your mommy loves you. Your mommy also needs to trim your nails. That's something to do tomorrow. So, got the vlogs up. I've Done a little putting around on social media because that's always fun. Um, sorry, my head's itchy. Um, to the dogs outside, took meds, but unfortunately, since I don't have my Ambien and I won't be getting it till tomorrow, guess what? It's gonna be a lot harder to get to sleep. And what was it? Oh, that's how the anxiety thing started with my grandmother on Friday. Because I mentioned that I didn't have my sleep meds, so I won't be able to sleep. And she had asked why, and I said because it's very difficult for me to fall asleep because my brain does not shut up. And then it goes from there. But, you know, at least tomorrow's Sunday I could sleep in. And I've got vlogs to catch up on and all the other videos. So, I've got things to do to keep me... <laughs> well, I probably shouldn't try to be keeping myself awake, but can't exactly get to sleep so what do you do and melatonin doesn't work for me I have tried melatonin apparently I was I'm not supposed to take 40 milligrams which is for the 10 milligram tablets my psychiatrist kind of chewed me out for it oopsie apparently that's bad but I survived but melatonin is not strong enough for me but Ambien works, because I think I might have mentioned this before, I was once on Clonopin for sleep, and it's designed also to calm down anxiety, well calm it down to go to sleep. It did work, it worked great, and the problem was it caused my major depressive disorder to get worse. Like I had a depressive episode that lasted four hours. That doesn't happen. They usually, at the most, will last 20 minutes. So, yeah, now I'm on Ambien, and Ambien's great, but, of course, I'm not advertising, oh, this medicine's greater than the other. One, that sounds like a drug dealer. And two, you know, medicines work differently with different people. Like, some people I know Wellbutrin worked well for them. For me, it didn't do anything at all. So, there you go, fun times. But now I'm going to sign up for the night, head off to bed, and try to sleep. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Question of the day is... Name somebody or something or whatever that you are their best blank. Like I just said, MRL has the best mommy in the entire world. Me. And I have some friends that probably have the best friend ever. So put your answers down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night, pupper doodles. I love you guys.